Students and local residents gathered on the green Sunday, September 18th to participate in the annual Community Day Fall Festival. With Delaware Avenue sectioned off for pedestrians, people were free to roam the green in search of snacks and homemade crafts. Live entertainment played on stage while families enjoyed fun activities like scarecrow making and face painting for the children. Religious organizations and interest groups had representatives advertising their messages to the public. Many of the tents proved to be pet friendly, and participants brought their friendly canine companions along to celebrate with them. From the giant Great Danes of the Mid-Atlantic Rescue to the litter of tiny Dachshunds yelping from their wagon. Many nonprofits were also on site to disseminate information about their cause. Hi, I'm Kelly Sackowitz with the Blood Bank of Delmarva. We cover um, the Delmarva Peninsula, so we cover all of Delaware, Cecil County, Maryland, and the lower and upper eastern shores of Maryland, and all the way down into Virginia. And we need 350 blood donors every day to keep our 16 area hospitals supplied. So we're here today to spread the word to the community um, about that need and also to advertise for our next University of Delaware blood drive, which is November 16th. This is a family vacation gone crazy. Two and a half years ago we went to Nicaragua, met some kids, they gave us some bracelets or pulseras. And long story short now, more than 100 schools in the United States sell these to uh, support kids in Nicaragua. And uh, all the funds that we raise, it's a nonprofit now, no longer a family vacation, and the money all goes back to support programs in Nicaragua. Even a local martial arts dojo set up demonstrations.